This is a brief demonstration for finding the missing sides of the irregular polygon which is shown. This polygon is a hexagon because it has six sides. Four sides are given, two sides are missing. The first missing side that we will find in this polygon will be the bottom. If I take a look at the other two horizontal measurements in the shape, I am going to slide those down to align them by the green segment. This demonstrates that the pink and blue segment combined has the same total length as the green segment, which means the length of my green segment should be the sum of 6 plus 4. The other missing side in my polygon is a vertical measurement. I am going to look at all my vertical measurements in this irregular polygon. Once again, I will slide the blue and the pink segments to align them beside the green segment. My blue and pink segment combined has the same total length of the green segment, which is 12 centimeters. The pink segment is already known to be 5 centimeters in length. In this situation, I will need to subtract my 5 centimeters from the total of 12 centimeters, which means my blue missing segment should have a length of 7 centimeters. By knowing all the sides of this irregular polygon, we could continue ahead to find the perimeter and also to find the area. We will do that at a different time. In conclusion, I am just going to kind of leave you with one final thought of how we will use this again in the future. We will find missing segments and sides of three-dimensional objects, which means we will be able to find surface area of these objects and find the volume. Also, this is kind of a brief introduction of the segment addition postulate. So we will revisit this concept at another time to pull this into the postulate to be used in geometric proofs.